Historically, mineral oils were the first to be used in power generating systems. However, increased temperatures and pressures in such systems led to development of fires after splashing of hydraulic fluids from damaged pipelines onto hot surfaces. Therefore, it became necessary to switch from mineral oils to fundamentally different fluids which would be characterized by fire resistance, that is a higher flash point, and self-extinguishing capability. One of such fluids is firecoal fire-resistant hydraulic fluid that will neither sustain combustion and feed the flame when they arise, nor spread in the stream of fluid discharged from the equipment under pressure. Thus, firecoal is now extensively used in electrohydraulic control systems of steam turbines, in lubrication of steam and gas turbines, in hydraulic systems of steel smelting furnaces, and in piston type air compressors. The manufacturers of firecoal fire resistant hydraulic fluid normally claim a long service life for their products, which can be commensurate with the service life of a steam turbine. However, this requires proper servicing. If such fluids are not serviced as required, it may lead to corrosion, valve jamming, and malfunctioning of the entire turbine. The most common problems encountered by firecoal fire resistant hydraulic fluid while in use include Hydration, which triggers the decomposition of phosphoric acid esters with formation of alcohols and acids. Oxidation, which, along with a high temperature, contributes to decomposition of firecoal fluid. Contamination and decomposition products cause a decrease in resistivity, and a low resistivity fluid can give rise to corrosion of valves. Clogging of filters When exposed to extreme temperatures, firecoal fluid develops dark particles, which cause silting of valves and accelerate clogging of fixed filters as time goes by. One of the options to prevent this kind of problems is to change fercal liquid to a new one. However, it entails high financial costs, including the cost of purchasing a new fluid, the losses associated with the downtime of power generating equipment, which may last up to two weeks or even longer, the cost of remuneration for workers changing the fluid, payment for disposal of waste fluid, purchase and disposal of flushing fluid. In a best case scenario, the cost of changing the fire resistant fluids will be measured in tens of thousands of dollars. And in the event of power generating equipment failure due to contamination of fire resistant fluid, losses may reach millions of dollars. Therefore, a good alternative to changing a firecoal fire resistant fluid is to maintain it in good condition through the use of special equipment that implements a procedure for periodic comprehensive removal of water and harmful impurities. Globecore has developed a technology for comprehensive purification of firecoal fire resistant fluids. This technology is implemented in CMM units which allow removing harmful impurities, water, and dissolved gases from firecoal fire resistant fluid within the capacity ranges from 1000 to 17000 liters per hour. After processing in accordance with Globecore technology, the quality of fire resistant fluid purification corresponds to purity class 14-12 of ISO 4406. Furthermore, a distinctive feature of CMM fire resistant fluid purifiers is the use of Biden seals, which are resistant to the effect of firecoal fire resistant fluid and enhance the reliability of its processing. Therefore, the use of globe core technology allows removing the harmful impurities from firecoal fire resistant fluid in a timely manner, extending its service life, and enhancing the operational reliability of power generating equipment. More information about the technology and the units for firecoal fire resistant fluid purification is available on our website www.globecore.com